Hey, what's going on, YouTube? It's Big Drink Not the one. Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back. Welcome back. We got a video here 03 Greedo and WAC 100 have been getting into it. Now, before we get into this video, I want you to drop a like and a comment down below. You know what I'm saying? You don't drop a like down below, but the button's down below. It's like underneath the video and shit. So make sure you hit that. Hit that button and then go to like where the box like area is where you can talk. Go there and drop like a four or a year or anything. Just let me know that you're here watching the video with us. And after that, make sure you click the subscribe button if you haven't because then you'll be entered in. Entered into what? The $100 giveaway. At 500 subscribers, you're giving away $100. Make sure you are one of them. No predetermined winners, no family members, nothing like that. Nothing like that. It's only going to one of y'all, to the supporters. Y'all support me. I'm gonna support y'all back with that $100. I don't care if I gotta ship it to you. $100 bill, get you a fucking Visa gift card, Cash App, Venmo, any of that. You're gonna make sure, we're gonna make sure you get <coughs> the $100. <coughs> Sorry, man. Anyway, let's get into the video. Like I said, O3 Greedo and uh, WAC 100 have been having a bit of a discourse, man. You know what's going on. WAC was claiming Greedo's from Sacramento. Was claiming that uh, the, the, the the reason that he had his comments about Kendrick Lamar's festival or his you know Ken with friends performance where he brought out everybody. The reason that he uh, wasn't there. He had some comments about that, and he was saying that you know those artists weren't going to get anything back from Kendrick. That they're essentially sucking dick by. Uh, submitting to what Kendrick wanted, he's not gonna, they ain't gonna get nothing in return, whatever, whatever the case may be. Wack then responded with a couple of different things to say and saying that you know, Greedo uh, is mad that you know, Kendrick isn't even used to that. He would, he had no intentions of doing that, he's not used to pay to play. That's how Greedo came in, essentially insinuating that Greedo is a pay to play crip pay to play rapper whatever the case may be in his section out here in LA and California these are wax words or my interpretation of wax words anyway Greedo then responded by saying uh this and, and we're gonna get into it but also what claim Greedo's not even from LA he claimed that he's from Sacramento and that's exactly what Greedo's responding to here in this clip uh that no jumper's talking about so let's get into that here drop over to the other screen for y'all about see what they gotta say so all three responded back to Wack claiming that he's not from Watts, that he's from that he's from Sacramento. He did say that. Um, yeah, I don't think that's true, right? Because Greedo has always been somebody who I've always um, have known was from Watts. So. Well, no, if you hear Greedo's story, he talks about the fact that he moved around a lot. Of course, like, of course yeah, of course. like he he but always. Greedo, I know Greedo, bro. I really know Greedo. Like I've been knowing Greedo. Like, I was doing songs with Greedo when nobody believed him. When he was greedy giddy still yeah, and all that. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah. Uh, and he's so hard, man. He's yeah, from he L.A. Like, like, his yeah. brothers Ooh. and shit, they all from L.A. It's like, if their parents moved around through whatever the case is, like, he didn't start in Watts. He moved around, and by the time he was in high school and all that shit, he was in Watts. When uh, it's time I've to gangbang and do all that shit, that's where you at. Which yeah. is very typical L.A. story. Yeah. You know what I mean? You in high school, yeah. bro, like, like you from there, right? Right, like Watts, right? Yeah, like yeah. right. And he, wait, right? And he's been there since, right? From 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 high school up to now. He probably moved to, yeah, yeah. I don't know. I can't tell you yeah. everywhere. I he doubt went, he but, lives in Watts but, still. But yeah, sure. Yeah. No, but what I'm but saying. But way, Greedo is Watts. That'd be crazy if Greedo sure. still yeah. lived in Watts. Yeah. Oh my yeah. God, that'd be I mean, insane. Like, look, like I, I know other people from over there, like from from the Jordan Downs, and they they were the ones who showed me originally, and they've been like he, Greedo. So Greedo he solidified. He's from over there. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, like his his exactly. hit song was was a song about one of the biggest Grape Streets. Yeah, and, yeah, and yeah. shouts to the homie Watts, the homies Watts Boys and all that, Key, Active, AJ, uh, Trey, Didi, they all, and yeah. Mafia Ray, they, they was coming to my, uh, battle rap events and back in the day, so I've been you know, no, those dudes. No, and according to eyewitnesses, right, um, at the party when that thing happened, yo, like his homies move militant, meaning like they all like formed a circle uh, around Greedo, and he was like well protected you feel me right so like yeah, is it true right like so like is greedo a trophy from his hood if y'all are out in cali let me know do y'all consider greedo a trophy from his hood especially with these recent comments claiming that he is from sacramento that's an interesting take from uh from lush not really anything crazy but and like regardless of like, like where he's say, good. i know some of y'all are probably from trump they did it uh trump did it bro again according to eyewitness yo 
That man Greedo moved like a president, like like he moved like a real like. Because it was according to eyewitness. What? Gordy got hit by straight bullets. So no, here, like, no, 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 here, right, here, no, true, right? But though, <laughs> when you have his homies form for like form yeah. a circle around him like yeah. fucking Voltron, right? Yeah. And not giving a fuck. <laughs> exactly. If they get hit, they just making sure that yeah, he's money. solid. Yeah. I said, nah, 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 nah. Nah, listen. Uh, so so this Flacco say that Gordy took a bullet for Greedo? Did Gordy take a bullet for Greedo for uh, did young Barry Gordy take a bullet for Greedo? Is that what we're getting insinuated here and or confirmed by Flacco? Did young Barry Gordy get shot trying to protect O3 Greedo? We need some confirmation. Let's see. That's what he's insinuating. I, yeah. That's what you I got. Have from to that be right the fuck. Is that if they get hit, they just make. No, 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 no. no. Here, right here. No, true, right? But though, when you have his homies form for like form yeah. a circle around him, like yeah. fucking Voltron witness, yo. That man Greedo moved like a president. Like, like he moved like a real like. Because it was a straight shooter. Nobody knows what happened. Gordy got hit by straight bullets. So no, here, like, no, 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 here, right here. No, true, right? Talk about but Gordy though, in that situation. When you have his homies form for like form yeah. a circle around him, like yeah. fucking Voltron. One of the homies and not formed a circle. Fuck. They didn't give exactly. a fuck. They, get hit. they just making sure. He got hit. He yeah. made sure Greedo didn't no, get no, hit. No, no, no. Oh, that's no, crazy no, no. work. You Blah, have to be a nigga from that's where you real. from, oh, and boy. niggas won't do that for you. Feel me? Well, and, and even uh, um, so, the whole point that Wack was making is basically that Greedo was speaking from a perspective of somebody that had to pay to get on. For but that's not true, right? Or is that again? I don't believe. I don't know nothing about like la politics my nigga so i can't even speak on it yeah I, i've never that that was his whole thing and and i don't think but but i, I also don't, don't necessarily I, agree I, I don't think he paid to get no nah, but i also don't necessarily <laughs> agree with greedo's original yeah. point that everyone that performed at that stage is like it wasn't a good idea and they burnt their relationship with drake no I, no no, no, I, don't no. Think that's I think if you performed on that no, stage you definitely no, burnt your relationship perform. with drake Y'all got what you, I mean, that's a good look, right? There's like 20 million people here watching. But the, the ones who just came on stage afterwards and participated, you feel me right? And kind of like, you know, in the Drake dissing. Okay. That's dumb. Cause so if that's you, what he was talking yeah, about. Yeah, right. Cause look, if you are a mean, rapper, right, yeah, who didn't perform, right? And you just coming on stage to now. To, to, that's actually a very good distinction between the two but i don't think that that's what greedo was talking about because he directly referenced performers and artists now if he's saying that the artists that were there you know i i don't I, it, that could be what he meant but what he said it was not a differentiation that flock was trying to make to like celebrate bro drink a petty nigga bro he like i yeah, you and, uh, noted, but at the end of the day, that's a yeah. hot West Coast beat. It's a hot West Coast cadence. Yeah. yeah. It's a hot song. If you take the words and put all mumbles there, motherfuckers still go be. Yeah. If yeah. you just put, they not like us. That's true. They, that's like, true. The song is about him, but like, it's niggas dancing to that song. Like, when it come on, I'm about my head, and I'm still a Drake fan. Drake is petty, though. Drake is petty. Yeah, yeah right? I, he is petty. And if you ain't but it's perform, like, it was not, you it's not your for relationship you. with Drake. Who? Drake, listen, everybody who did have a relationship with Drake, if you popped up on that stage, you was choosing sides on purpose because Drake ain't been reaching out to fucking with you. Oh, that's a Let's good take. Real. I mean, if hey, you did have a relationship with Drake and you popped out, that was definitely you choosing sides. But anything outside of that, I mean, uh, if you're from the West Coast, Brick has a good point. It's a very hot beat. It's a moment in West Coast history right now. You know what I'm saying? Popping out, being involved in that kind of just makes sense almost on a social cue level. And half them artists was never finna get a feature with, from Drake. With the heavy Cuban. Yeah. Well, he, more what, than half. What, well, here, 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 but this 99% was, yeah. of them. Here, right? Here, here, right? And this is what Greedo said, right? Was, yo, listen. Y'all are being used as a pawn to sort of show the muscle against Drake. So, again, for example, right? If Drake gave gave like Draco a, a feature, right? The chances are, if you are the next poppin' nigga in LA like Greedo and others, 
they have a chance to get a, a Drake feature. So if right. you are Greedo, yeah. and you're not being called to perform, you're just being called to hop on stage and show muscle, well, Drake, okay, well, then no, no, yeah. no. If I'm never going. So he's like saying, was it really worth it if you didn't get to perform in front of 20 million people mm -hmm. and you just hop on stage to show, yeah, bro, you feel me? Yo, I'm West Coast 2, we showing love. Yeah. Then, bro, you got tricked out your position. That's actually a really good take and a good point by Flacco, but I don't know if Greedo was directly making that type of correlation or directly saying that. You know what I mean? That might have been what he meant and maybe what his mind was thinking, but it, I don't think he. I don't think he, uh, he. 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 He didn't. He wasn't eloquent enough in his in his speaking to have said it that way. You know what I'm saying? He didn't. He didn't. Get, it didn't come across that way. It came across way different and i think the way that people taking it is kind of justified that's just my opinion though let me know what y'all think down below in this whole situation they didn't speak on much in regards to greedo responding to his claims about him being from sacramento uh but hey that is what wax said wax did claim that Wack claimed it actually they did they did they spoke about it you know let me know what you think down below if you think moving around also uh has nothing to do with it i mean it's kind of where do you think your formative years start they said that he went to high school in sacramento or i'm sorry at la uh but he had some time in sac i mean what where, where what are your formative years for real like when do you really become a man at i would say if you went to high school somewhere and did those years that that that's a that's a lot especially if you did middle school or anything similar in that area as well but that means a lot, you know what I'm saying? I, I would say that Grudos from LA, that's where I've always known him to be from, and if, if that's the background that people from there are saying that he has, then I would say that it, that it fits and it matches. But let me know what y'all think down below. Make sure you hit that uh, subscribe button, drop a comment, hit the like button, and turn those notifications on at 500. We're giving away that $100. Make sure you're one of them. I'll see y'all in the next video.